And it was like your hat was ripped right out of your chest. A Boston firefighter's helmet stolen from a fire truck. Brian Carey has had that same helmet since he became a firefighter more than 30 years ago. He has it with him on every job until someone took it. As Paul Burton explains, Brian just wants the helmet back, no questions asked. It, it is literally a part of you. It's, uh, it's, it's gone everywhere you've gone. Boston firefighter Brian Carey says a firefighter's helmet is a badge of honor. The history of your whole career on this job and everything that you've done, every fire you've been in, every incident you went to, I earned everything that's the damage that's on that helmet. Brian says a year ago, someone stole his leather helmet, which he had hidden underneath his coat in the back of this truck. And kept it stored back in here, so wrapped up it was out of sight. So somebody that had to deliberately go look for it. Brian recently took to social media asking anyone who's seen his helmet to please return it. Instead of being a memorabilia for me to look back on my career, it's, it's a, uh, now it's a conversation piece in somebody's collection. Brian's been on the job for 31 years. He comes from a long line of firefighters. His two brothers are firefighters. His father was also a Boston firefighter. Brian says he plans to retire in about four years. His dream was to take his helmet and place it next to his late father's helmet because that's where it belongs. I, uh, my father passed away in 1980 uh, and I have his helmet at, at my house now and uh, I, was, I was planning on someday having mine and his sitting together in a nice place of honor in my home. Although he knows the chances of someone returning his helmet are slim, he's not giving up. In Boston, I'm Paul Burton, WBZ News.